Hi everyone and welcome to part 50 of the Montoya Family Let's Play. I can't believe we made it to 50 parts because uh, when I started this Let's Play I wasn't sure that we'd make it this far because I you know how The Sims 3 can be. But yeah, we've come this far in this Let's Play and uh, Avalon went off to her first day of work that not, not that long ago and uh, Alex did have work today but I had him take a vacation day because I didn't really want to want him to do the whole lifeguard thing today so... What I'm going to have him do instead is do a little bit of diving and work towards getting another island because I was looking into it and there's actually three, not two more islands that we need to get and we only have this part and two more parts of this Let's Play left so we're probably not going to be able to get all three of them but I would like to at least get one. So I'm going to try for one called Diver's Den and uh, all you have to do to get that one is just have a max style diving skill and go through a cave. So I'm hoping we have better luck, better luck with caves and we can actually get it, although he's a little bit tired. But I think hopefully he'll be good to do a little bit of exploring. So uh, I believe the cave that we need to get is at Pearl's Deep, which is over here. And I realize that this is one. I'm Actually, no, we're going to boat near it because I don't really want to deal with the time it takes to have him swim there. Um, but I thought this was one that we had gone to before, but it turns out it wasn't because I was looking at what levels of the diving skill certain diving spots are unlocked and this one is unlocked at level nine so i know for sure we haven't gotten to it and i also read that when you become a mermaid their diving skill automatically goes up to level 10 because i thought it was kind of weird that it was all of a sudden at level 10 i think it was at five or six before so um oh shoot he's drying up Ooh. okay uh well he's gonna hopefully uh, he's gonna hopefully get here soon i just i just didn't want to deal with the time it takes for him to swim all the way over here but yeah I think any minute now I should be getting here and we can have him dive underwater so that'll take care of any hydration issues that he's having so yep dive underwater and I'm excited to see this place because I haven't looked at it yet yeah unfortunately there's only four dive spots which isn't really a ton okay dude get out of your boat go dive underwater yeah there we go all right, and uh, yeah, it's a little, a little more tired. I didn't realize he's so tired. I mean, if it comes down to it, I, you know, like he's getting really tired. I don't want to believe I might cheat his knees a little bit. Uh, yeah. Okay, what are we doing? We're gonna go look at some stuff. Oh, this place is cool. It's like, it's like ancient ruins. Oh, that's so neat. What is this? Collect. What is that? Oh, it's a, it's a. Oh, oh, it's a shell. I thought it was like a fish skeleton at first. No, I think that's some kind of interesting shell or. Some kind of sea plant. Huh. Neat. Uh, let's see what other cool stuff we can find here. I mean, imagine this place has pretty cool stuff considering it's the highest leveled. Ooh, rare ancient fish fossil. Nice. So it was actually fish bones. Um, I'd imagine this place has some really good stuff seeing as it's the last dive spot you unlock. So we'll check out that chest. We'll just look all around here. Uh, hopefully the cave that's here actually works because yeah I have a feeling this is the one that takes you to the island oh is this another chest oh yes oh we have a little eel over here we'll get that we can eat it or sell it for a bunch of money wow okay so we got 5,000 simoleons a large crystal ball cut rainbow gem large plutonium ingot emerald mr. mariner gnome ruby and yellow sapphire nice I think that's a bunch of stuff we can sell for a bunch of simoleons yeah, nothing we... Ooh! Ooh, a little puffer fish! Oh, it's so cute! Let's catch it! Yeah, I like the whole diving thing in The Sims 3. Yeah, I don't think this is anything. We caught eel worth 854 simoleons, a rare find. That's awesome. Is this a thing? Okay, so this is the cave. Uh, yeah, I don't think that's gonna... Although I think... Ah, uh, no, I was hoping that you could... Hmm... Okay, it's not working. Yeah, because I think tentacles have to be coming out of it, which is... Oh, it's so annoying. Maybe there's some way I can reset it if I turn the testing cheats on. I don't I don't think so. We'll just carry on and look around for other stuff. Yeah, okay, what are you doing? No, 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 no. Okay, he's getting tired enough that he wants to go home. I am not done here yet, so I'm going to be a little cheaty here. And we're going to just up his knees, which um, I don't normally like to do but I'm just uh, ah did I did I get it okay I cheated his energy up a little bit and uh, turned the cheats back off he is hungry so what is this oh yes we'll do that for sure um I wanted to see if we could have him eat is this worth a lot of money okay that's worth like nothing so um wait no 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 what are you doing no oh I don't know if he left yet but uh we'll just have him 
eat the tragic clownfish. Sorry. I don't know. I feel kind of bad in a way having him. No, what are you? Ah, get back underwater. You can eat the fish down there. Right? You should be able to. All right. Alex is back underwater. He's eating some food. Hopefully, he should be good to go. Ooh, that's a shell we can get. So, we'll just grab that. And, uh, ooh, a little shark. I think, yeah, this is one of the smaller ones that you could just catch. So, we'll grab that. Uh, let me see if we have any better... No, I don't think we're going to have better luck with the cave. Yeah. Yeah, the whole the whole cave's not functioning right thing is really annoying. Ooh, there's another fish. So, wait, did we get the... Do we, I don't think we got... I don't remember if we got both of the treasure chests. I think that was the second one I picked. Yeah, I don't remember if we got that one. Ooh, we got an uncommon angelfish. Yeah, we got that one, so we didn't open this one over here yet. So let's see what good stuff we get. Uh, that probably wasn't a very good screenshot. Oh, well. Uh, we got a rare ancient fish. Oh, wait, no, never mind. That was something. Oh, so we got 3,000 smoins, ancient fish fossil, three gold, large marquee cut, lumin luminorious. What is that? Luminorious gem? That's nice. Yeah, I don't know if there's... Anything else around here? Wait, is that a little, ooh, little lobster? That sounds good. Oh, and then this cave still isn't functioning correctly. So I think I'm gonna have to give up on trying to get this cave to work for now because I turned on the testing cheats and built one to, into buy mode on the slot and picked this up, put it back down, deleted it and undid it and stuff like that. And it's still not working. And then I had him try, I had him try going into it and of course that didn't work. So yeah, I don't know what to do with this because none of the caves are working and it's really frustrating. So I don't know if any of you know any other fixes for it other than picking up and putting it down. Because that's what I've heard is supposed to work, but it just doesn't work. And it's just really getting in the way of having him complete his his lifetime wish. Um, but I mean, at least while we were down here, we got some good stuff. So it wasn't a complete loss. I just I just really wish we could have gotten an island because all he has to do is go through this cave. Like He's got the level 10 diving skill. There's just... It, it's just frustrating. Like, we should be able to. I mean, I don't know if I have to delete it and then replace it, but then I don't know if, if that'll exactly work. It, I don't know. Yeah, so if anyone knows a way to fix that, um, I'd love to know because I really want him to get another island before the end of this, and we just seem to not have, be having very good luck with getting the last few islands. And then um, I think the last one was the one that had something to do with finding messages in a bottle or something like that. I think so... Yeah. Oh, there's... Oh, right. Sharks. So apparently, um, I looked up, so sharks also don't attack mermaids. So that's a good thing. Oh, and I read something. Oh, another sim attracted to Avalon. And I also read something about how if you have an evil sim, they can... So yeah, I guess they have to actually have the evil trait to summon sharks. But yeah, like evil evil mermaids can summon... Oh, tentacles! Tentacles! <gasps> Let's explore. Okay, okay. Screw looking at that thing. We're going to go into the cave because it's got tentacles coming out of it. And that's a good thing in this case. <gasps> we might just get an island. I can't, okay, okay, come on, come on, come on, before the tentacles go away, get over there, get your butt over there, please tell me it works, I'm gonna be so pissed off if this, if this doesn't work. I mean, maybe it's still reset. It's not, <gasps> you guys, I think a cave finally worked. Oh my gosh, yes, I can't believe this. Oh, I'm so happy, I'm so glad we're gonna get another island, like, that just makes me feel so accomplished, because, I mean, it, we're not going to be able to finish his lifetime wish, most likely, but, I mean, at least we're going to be coming a little closer to it, so I'm going to guess this takes a good bit of time. Uh, also, Avalon got home from work a long time ago. Where are you? Go home! What are you doing? You're not even... Oh, let's see. Alex definitely grabbed an electric eel and used it to recharge his phone. Woo, that was... Why do you have a phone down here? I mean, you must have some kind of hardcore waterproof case to do that. Uh, I don't even know what Avalon was doing. She was just off somewhere else the whole time. Um, so we'll get her home because she's really tired. I think she has work the next day too. Oh, shoot. What happened? Did she just never go to work? I'm going to be so pissed off if that's what happened. Darn it. Uh, let's see. An expansive patch of bioluminescent lichen reminded Alex that he should really clean out his... F oh, that's not good if that reminds you of your fridge. That's disgusting. Okay, yeah. You get on home. Uh, get some sleep. Yeah, I'll have to keep a closer eye on her tomorrow to make sure she actually goes to work. Oh, I'm so excited. We're going to get an island. I guess this just takes a good bit of time. But yeah, that makes this whole diving expedition feel a little more worthwhile. 
What do we have now? Ox was delighted to find one of those fanciful underwater orchestra or what? orchestras, but it turns out that fish beating on shells or coral just produces an atonal mess. Oh well. What are you? Are you going into the Little Mermaid? Little Mermaid universe? Okay, we lost a we lost a friend. Okay, whatever. Nope, all right, nothing I really care about. Uh, is Avalon home yet? Nope, still working on that. What's Gabrielle doing? Out? Just sitting around. Ooh, yes, you have found a new exit to the cave system. Do you wish to see where it leads? Yes, why would I pick no? It's gonna be a new island. Let's see, while exploring the cave, Alex Montoya found a second exit out of the cave system and discovered an island, Diver's Den. Yes, we also found a cowrie shell. Nice, this is our new island. Are we actually on it? Oh, yes, we are. That's so cool. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but we got it. Oh, a treasure chest. Is that a treasure chest? Yes, that's a treasure chest. I wonder if there's anything else around here that's good. Yeah, I don't know if there's really anything over on this island, but ah, so exciting. This is a pretty nice little place. Yeah, I mean, not much of it is probably actually buildable. Ooh, 1,000, what's that? 1,200 simoleons, gold, iron, palladium, and silver. Awesome, that's a pretty good, that's a pretty good haul. Uh, but he is really, really tired. So I'm just gonna have him go ahead and boat on home. Yeah, yeah, we, we really need to get him home. Okay, so we're just gonna pick boat here so he gets back home a little bit quicker. But everyone's probably gonna be sleeping now, so I'll just pick back up the next morning. So Alex just got up and Avalon's already off for work and I wanted to check to see if there were any other, any new dogs up for adoption. And since Avalon's off for work, we're just gonna have him go ahead and do it instead. I think that's, I think that's Gabrielle getting a call. Um, anyway, yeah, services, adopt pet from sh Oh, what is this? Um, I mean, I don't know if I'm actually gonna end up doing that. Wait, was that for, oh no, no, okay. I don't know what was going on with him. Anyway, yeah, let's two services, adopt pet from shelter. See if maybe there's any new puppies or dogs that we can adopt. Um, yeah, hopefully there is. Or if not, maybe there's some new pets around the neighborhood. We'll see. Fingers crossed, because I really want to adopt another dog. Uh, okay, so we've got... Okay, so these are all the same dogs. I think these are going to... Ah, wait. Is that... Ah, no, it's a regular... It's not a small dog. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll check the neighborhood adoption up here. And, I mean, if not, maybe... Maybe I'll just get... I uh, just get a dog anyway. I don't know. Don't necessarily have to have to potentially have them have puppies with Guppy. Oh, that rhymes. Um, so I don't know. Maybe I could just adopt a dog anyway, and then later on I could have them get another one. I don't know. Because I kind of just really want them to adopt another dog. But we'll see if we have anything other than the Hamada family's cats. Do we? Okay, nope. That's it. You know what? I, I think I'm just going to go ahead and get another have them get another puppy. Why not? I mean, I could check and maybe have them adopt a third dog for the end of the Let's Play. I don't know, because I just I just really want them to adopt something, you know, adopt a dog. I just really want them to do that. Uh, so do we want to go with the puppy? I mean, this dog looks like he might be kind of cute, or do we want to give an adult dog a chance? I don't know, it's always good to give adult adult animals chances, because everyone goes for puppies and kittens, so they tend to be looked over a lot. Yeah, we could do that. Um, this dog's a genius too, which is good. So, yeah, we'll just, yeah, sure, we'll just adopt her. Why not? Uh, oh, right, 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 right. So a bunch of you left pet names on, what was it, like part 47, I think? Part 46, part 47? I think it was part 47. Yeah, so I'm going to go look at that, pick some names from there. So Miguel suggested Ariel. And I'm gonna go with that. I like it. It's kind of a, it's kind of related, you know, kind of a water-related name, like Ariel the Mermaid. I think that kind of goes with Guppy, because wasn't her? No, I don't think her friend was named Guppy. I think, oh no, it's Flounder, but I think he's called Guppy sometimes, maybe. So it kind of works. So we'll adopt her and we'll name her Ariel. And um, yeah, I might, I might just get a puppy or another dog later on before the Let's Play ends. We'll see. But yeah, at least we got another dog coming in for here for now, so Guppy can have a buddy to play with. I think it'll be good for him to have another dog. Oh, look at that. Ari or, um, I was about to call her Ariel. No, Gabrielle's playing with her, with him. That's cute. Uh, how's this mood doing? Pretty good. Yeah, let's see if we can have him go get some collectibles. Yeah, so let's locate a gem. Did he have anything? No, he doesn't have anything good in his inventory. 
Uh, yeah, so excited to get this dog. Uh, what did I say that that she'd be getting here in a couple hours? I mean, it'd probably be a really long time anyway with how they, how long it takes them to get around the island. Okay, were you? Oh, I guess he can't. He can't get over here to locate collectibles. All right, let's do that. And I also, once Avalon gets home from work, which I think should be soon, I also wanted her to invite Gustav to come over and visit, so um, he could come over as soon as he can. I'm not. I think it takes a little bit before they show up. Like, I think they show up the next day. So if that's the case, then I'll probably have her take off work. I don't think she has any vacation days yet, though. Uh, oh, right, I had her... Oh, uh, yeah, she's really stressed out because I had her work hard to try to get her performance up some because it was so low from the previous day. But uh, what was I going to do? Oh, right, I was going to see if she had... A, if she could take a... Well, she could take unpaid time off. So I think I might just do that. I would take what is this? Oh, he gained the hunter trait. That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, so I think I'll just if he does if Gustav does come over the next day, I'll just have her take the day off so she can spend time with him. There's so many dog toys all over the place. Jeez. What do you do? Oh, he's uh, what is he doing? His good hot dogs. Okay, cool. Actually, instead of instead of sending her all the way home. We could ever do the whole pick a spot in town and create street art thing. Oh, why are you wearing your graduation gown? Okay, no, let's uh, let's get you into proper clothing. You know, you don't want to just walk around in your graduation gown like months after graduation. No. Okay, let's go change back. Oh wait, was that the was that the dress? Okay, no, that's not the dress. Wait, actually, I want her in the dress. There we go, her island dress. Uh, so she could call here and set up the whole visit for Gustav. Wait, why? I don't know why he's showing up there. Hmm. Might have to do something from from the phone. Okay, yeah, we can invite foreign visitors. So, why is he... That's really weird that he's not... Okay, so apparently he's somehow already in this world, so I guess we'll ask him out on a date. That's weird. Ooh, we can go on a date to the summer fiesta. Yeah, that sounds good. Maybe she could do some artwork. Okay, yeah, apparently I... It, it's a, it's some kind of glitch, so I don't know if he's just gonna... Uh, that was weird. I don't know if he's gonna leave at some point just in the middle of this date. We'll see how it goes. I don't know. We could just pretend that he... Oh, Ariel's here! Awesome. Uh, yeah, so she could go play with her once she gets back home. But, um... Yeah, I, I guess, I don't know. We could just go with he already... She already invited him out over here. Okay, so it's just stuff saying that we're sorry. I, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, so never mind. He's not gonna be coming. Yeah. Okay. Now, now apparently now he's back over in France. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna try the whole invite foreign visitors again. Yeah. And hopefully this time it should work properly. Yeah. There we go. Gustav Delvin. Yay. We're gonna invite him to visit. Do it the right way this time. Hopefully no glitches. Your guests will arrive. Yeah, that's what I thought. They arrive the next day. So she's got the rest of the day until then. So in the meantime, let's have her get to take care of this whole pick a spot in town and create street art thing. Uh, so we can do a ground mural. Let's do a medium one. Just, just stick it right there. Okay, go take care of that. And then after that, she can head on home. But for now, we're going to go back over to the house because the newly adopted dog just came. So we want to have them play with her for a little bit. Uh, hopefully she's... Oh, is it toilet? Oh, uh, ugh. Okay, toilet's gross. Let's, uh, let's unclog it. Yeah, we'll just do that. Uh, so anyway, where is, where's our new bundle of joy? Or ball of fur? Oh, look at that. There's Ariel Montoya. What kind of dog? I, I know I said that, that, um, she was a mutt. She looks kind of cool, though. Yeah, not quite... Not quite what I was going after, but yeah, I just really wanted to add a new dog to the family so we can have Avalon get on home and play with her for a little bit. So what what it was what does Guppy want to do? Sniff Ariel. Okay, this this is okay. That's really loud. I'm gonna, I'm gonna gonna turn that off really quick. Okay. Uh, what are you doing? Reacting negative. All right. So let's have you go up and sniff her, get to know her a little bit. <laughs> oh, look at that. They both... Oh, they're like twins. They're both barking at the TV. I hope they get along. Okay, we're gonna do... Ooh! Nice! A thousand simoleons. 
Okay, so now that she's done that, let's have her head on home. Oh, they're sniffing. Uh, is there anything else we could have them do? Yeah, because I, I just really wanted to play buddy. So we could have them goof around, play together. I just, I love having the pets interact with each other. See, look at that. They're already best buds right off the bat. Aw. I have a feeling these two are going to become fast friends. So what else can we do? Socialize. Oh, look at that. Gabrielle's already bonding with her as well. Yeah, I wonder what her, how's her relationship with Guppy. Okay, not that much. It's not that high up yet, of course. Oh, so she already is part of the part of the way through. Okay, so she just newly aged up into adult. So she's still pretty young. She's like a one or two year old dog. Not that old. She's still got a lot of, lot of life ahead of her. Is it? Did she just lay on the? She just lays on the ground to eat food. <laughs> but oh, Guppy's waiting his turn. I might have to get another bowl for these two. Yeah, I don't think one bowl's enough for these two dogs. Okay, we're gonna get rid of. This really quickly, don't really need that, and just, uh, yeah, I think I still have the move objects cheat on, so we'll just plop that over there. So now we'll have two bulls for them. Should be good. Okay, uh, let's get her to, actually, I think Avalon, okay, no, no, Avalon's still getting home. Oh, no, she just got home. Okay, so we'll have her go ahead and fill up the bowl. Oh, look at that, Guppy's going to greet her. Oh, wait, is Ariel, oh, Ariel's going to greet her, too. Aw. So cute. I love how they greet them. Although, unfortunately, it makes it kind of difficult for them to her to get up the stairs. Like, look, they're just completely blocking the stairs. Oh, looks like she's figuring out, though. Okay, then. Uh, yeah, Ariel, you're probably gonna. Okay, stop greeting her. You need you need to move out of the way. All right, we got the food. So let's have her go say hi to Ariel, who looks like is napping. Okay, so we're just gonna go wake her up, have her give her a little bit of attention. And get her fun up too, because her fun is still pretty low. So what can we do? We can, uh, no, let's not ask to bring the newspaper. We can, we can talk to her. Uh, feed her a treat, just win her over. Which I'm sure Avalon will. Okay. Come on. Where's she going? Oh, they're going outside. I'm probably also going to need to get a bigger bigger dog bed. Did I, did I even have a dog bed for Guppy? I think I put a dog bed in, but it was a smaller one. So it's not really going to fit her. Oh, why is the gaming so laggy? Okay, so we can... Uh, oh, should we start... We, eh, we'll wait a little bit. She, we, she just got here, so we'll wait a little bit for, for trying to teach her tricks. Yeah, she seems like a really friendly dog, though. Oh, she has a lazy trait. I think that's why she was trying. She was laying on the ground while eating her food. Okay, so we can. Ooh, let's rub her belly. Will she let us do that? Will she? I'm not sure. There might be something where we might have to earn her trust a little bit more before she lets us do that. We'll see. <gasps> she gonna? Oh yes, she's so trusting. Aw, she seems like a good dog. Yay. Aw. I love animals. <laughs> I really hope... I, so, um, there are rumors that the next Sims 4 expansion pack is going to be pets. Um, because it was something like... They found code for cats and dogs in the recent patch. Like, I think it was for, like, walks or something. I can't remember exactly what it was for, but it was for some kind of interaction involving cats and dogs. So it seems like it's likely pets might be the next expansion pack, or at least, you know, we'll be getting pets at some point. So I'd be pretty happy if we... Oh, what, what are you doing now, Gabrielle? What are you going to do? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Are you going to... Who are you messing with? She's going to mess with someone. But it looks like... Oh, actually, before you... So before you head off to bed, let's have you go ahead and... Why is this being so slow? Okay, good. I swear it's going to crash. Um, anyway, so we're going to have her go ahead and take one day of unpaid time off so she can... Yep, she has, does have to work, like, will work the next day. So we'll have her take that day off so that she can spend the time with Gustav the next day. And who on earth were you just scaring? I don't know if she's just scaring Alex somehow or what. Uh, but yeah, what time is it? It's 10. Yeah, so she's starting to get really tired. How tired is Alex? Yeah, Alex is getting pretty sleepy. For some reason, her energy never goes down. 
And I can't remember if that was something to do with fairies or whether it's just a glitch that's going on, but either way, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna skip to the next morning when Gustav gets here. So it's pretty early the next morning and Gustav should be getting here in a couple of hours, which is pretty exciting. I'm probably not going to play through the whole day. Uh, just another part of the day, I wanted to get a little bit of Gustav's visit in here, but I also noticed this is broken, so we're just going to go ahead and have Alex call repair technician. Ooh, also, while Guppy's up here, let's have him interact with Ariel a little bit more so we can have... <gasps> can they nuzzle? Oh, let's see if they can nuzzle. I think it's, oh, I think it's so cute when the dogs nuzzle with each other. Okay, so I want to see if they can do this. Are they gonna? All right, repair technician coming in an hour. Are they seriously gonna? Okay, what what is she doing? Okay, no, 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 no. Stay up here. Go here. There's not enough room. Oh, oh, she's trying to play fetch with Ariel. Yeah, I don't want them to go all the way downstairs to do the whole nuzzling thing. But yeah, oh, why is she backing up like that? Okay, let's see if I, I think it'll work. But yeah, I just think it's I think it's a. Oh wait, actually, let me get the walls up. Looks a little bit better like that. But yeah, I just think it's adorable when the different dogs nuzzle with each other. Are they gonna- No! No, they couldn't nuzzle! Oh, that's so disappointing. I guess we had to work on their relationship a little bit more. So we'll just socialize with him. Yeah, because I really want them to become buddies. I'm pretty sure you- What, what are you doing now, Gabrielle? I'm just gonna go scare someone again. I'm pretty sure you can't have small dogs and large dogs. No, no, don't do that. Don't do that. I'm pretty sure you can't have large and small dogs breed with each other. I mean, I think that would, wouldn't really work that well with how they make the game. Uh, but I don't... Oh, no, 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 okay, that's a socializing thing. Right, right, I wasn't sure if, like, he was... She was, neg like, meanly barking at him or something like that. But no, I think they're... Yeah, I think they're doing something that's gonna help them get along a little better. So that's good. Uh, let's see, it's 8.30, half an hour till... Wait, are they nuzzling? Oh, no, 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 there's nothing. They're not nuzzling. That's still cute, though. There we go. Let's see, look at these two getting along. So we can have them goop around a little bit again. Yeah, I love seeing them interact. <gasps> oh, there we go. Pay that. Someone, what is this? Someone around town has been spreading rumor that Gabrielle Arias got arrested. Who? Oh, come on. Oh, right. She became a one-star celebrity from Avalon. Okay, you gonna go do the? Oh, I guess they're going downstairs to goof around. Alrighty then. Uh, what is Avalon doing? Oh, I think it's almost time for Gustav to get here too. Yay! Ah, why is this? Ah, hopefully the next time I open up the game, it'll be a little less laggy. But let's go that she's talking to him more. Your visitors have just arrived. Be a good host and greet them before they feel unwelcomed. <gasps> There's Gustav! Okay, sorry. We're gonna stop talking to you. We're gonna talk to him instead. So we'll greet him. Greet, greet, greet. Here we go. so exciting. Hopefully this whole visit goes well. Wait, who- who was that running by in a bathing suit? Wait, what? Donna- why is someone- why is someone just running around her house in a bathing suit? Alrighty then. Uh, did we- did we greet him? Come on, greet, please. Alright, she's finally greeting him. I like how they do the little- oh, really? Okay, why is this popping up again? Yeah, I like how they do the little European kiss on the cheek thing. So, I don't know, we'll show a funny video to him. And I uh, might as well just get right to the chase and we'll throw with him a little bit. Uh, all right, fine. Go perform your work. Yeah, I didn't really have anything planned for- why, why, why is this not working? Oh, okay. I, I don't- he's gonna go do it, so I think it'll be fine. But yeah, I didn't really have anything else planned for him today, so he can go off to work. All right, we're gonna go flirt. Ooh, we can have her sing the romantic song, which I think was- is this one? Yeah, so we'll have her do that. Uh, let's see. Oh, that was a repair. T oh, that was who went by in a bathing suit. Oh, okay. I don't know why she showed up in her bathing suit. Yeah, this is the romantic song. Yeah, she's not really that good of a singer, but it looks like he likes it. Yeah, so probably not gonna play through this too much, but I think I'll start off the next part by having them go on a date somewhere in Isla Paradiso. So we can also so just give him a kiss, hug him, all that good stuff. But yeah, I have a feeling things are going to go pretty well for this. And uh, yeah, if it goes well, I want to have her ask him to be her boyfriend. I, mean, I feel like he'd probably say yes to that. I don't think we'll get that at this point, though. Yeah, no, it's not showing up now. 
Uh, sweet kid. Ooh, let's take another, let's take a romantic photo together so she can hang that up. She still is the one from before, but I think it'd be good to have a new one to hang up. So for, oh, I just realized, I don't think I got the photos that she had in her dorm with Lee back. Ah, darn. You know, I should probably have her invite Lee to visit too sometime. Might be good, because, you know, she was her best friend in college, so... Um, well, we've only got two parts left. I don't know. Maybe if I have time, I'll have her invite Lee over as well. We'll see. Okay, so going to do the whole take a picture thing. Oh, I don't want to get a picture of it. Let's try to get the bubble out of there as much as possible. See, there we go. How cute. Okay. Oh, wait. We didn't even invite him inside. But I think I'm going to have this be where I wrap up the part. So, yeah, next time we'll start off with her spending more time with Gustav and then going out on a date and all that good stuff. Uh, but, yeah, I feel like we we did a good bit in this part. So I'll leave it off here. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And bye.